Hello dear colleagues, now I will give you a few figures concerning the construction of our new innovative center. The innovative center will be constructed on the site number 16 in the special economic zone. This is the site, it's allocated here, about 20,000 square meters. That's a bit more than 2 hectares. Our main block that consists of two buildings. To be more precise, there will be one building having two constituent parts. We'll be located at this site. This is the administration and amenity complex and production complex. The administration and amenity complex will mainly accommodate our management and process and design engineers. The production complex is where the main activities will take place. Testing what our design engineers are making, producing batches of motors, adjusting technological processes. And the main subject matter will be making money and producing our goods. In order to show you more or less detailed design project of the ANA complex, administration and amenity complex, since ANA is the central part of the design, we will go to another stand. So, we really wanted the design project of a building to be developed for us. We were shown one of the pictures. That's what the administration and amenity complex will be like. But we have asked our contractors to give us a real product to have a look at what it is made of. So, we can see on this table what it will look like. The administration and amenity complex will look basically like this. This is a structural element. The color of the administration and amenity complex will be black with darkening glass like this. The production complex looked like this in our design project. And our colleagues have provided materials and colors that will be used on the site. Have a look, there will be three colors. The main one is light, dark and maroon. This is the light color. About 70% of the production premises will be made of it. This is the dark color. The wings where the infrastructure is located will be made of it. And the maroon color. We use it to emphasize the idea that our production is connected with the energy industry. That's what it will look like in the nutshell. In order to explain you in detail what the innovative center will be like, we are going to have a look at the layouts. Now we are going to the grade level. The total area of the administration and amenity building is around 520 square meters. And the total area of the production building at zero level is 6030 square meters. The administration building will have the main entrance with the sliding gates and then the security turnstiles. We are crossing a small hall where the robot will be meeting us. This robot will have several functions. First, it will perform face recognition of our center staff and provide immediate access to those visitors who place a request in advance. The robot will scan the passport and let them in. As for the people who haven't made a notifying request, the robot will offer them to wait and inform the contact person who has invited the visitor. When crossing the entrance control post, we see a large over 100 square meter showroom. 
In the showroom, there will be an exhibition of what we have achieved, our future plans, and a small room for presentations and meetings. There will be a small cafe here, as well where our visitors or staff members can have a meal, drink some tea, and socialize. After that, we are entering the production building. The production complex will have wardrobe rooms, showers, meal rooms, and the main production area, which is currently divided into the laser cutting and welding areas, processing area, blank preparation area, and casting area. Here there will also be the measurement and research laboratory. Down here we will have the paint coating area, and then as we can see it's the infrastructure zone. Here we will have the heat supply unit, cooling center, gas supply systems. This highlighted area here is for the storage facilities and rooms. This is zero in the most manifold way. Level 2. In the administration and amenity complex, about 500 square meters, there will be the management personnel, chief executive officer, marketing department, accounting, legal department, and a small room for training the personnel, process engineers, and our design engineers. And also, the open level 2 is for the production area, and some small premises for the principal engineer's office and inventory and logistics area. Level 3 The a and complex of around 570 square meters and production area of around 5000 square meters. On level 3 in the a and complex, there will be our design and process engineers. That is our think tank. That's why we have tried to provide, at least at the pre-project stage, and it will be the same in the project too, the most comfortable conditions for our people engaged in the creative activity. In the production area here, there will be assembly of those things without which the operation of electric motors or hub motors is impossible. Here we will assemble control units and hubs there will be the cable sections, i.e. everything for getting the end product. On the whole, the construction is to be completed in two years. I think that all of our endeavors, the tasks we have already completed and which we will be working on, will let us successfully move to our new innovative center in two years. Thank you.